1024, here's meteorologist Tom DeVecchio, your weather authority. Some sunshine greets us as we head into the afternoon. Bob Ferrando, Ford World Weather Cam. This one in Girard, and uh, it's been a beautiful morning. Deceptively chilly out there, though. Uh, temperatures, many of you have been able to hit 30 despite the sunshine, despite the fact that we're, well, just a few hours away from the month of March. Uh, temperature 30 at Penn State Barron. Becky's actually at 31 in French Creek, 27 Cory, 28 in Union City. Joe, a cold 26 out there in Northeast. And we have a 31 right now in Sagertown, New Richmond. Uh, we're looking at uh, about 25 Leroy with that temperature. Ed West Mead, 27, 30 in Meadville, and 30 degrees as well uh, for Kathy out there in Youngsville. So uh, we do have some uh, ice out in the lake here. You can see starting to get covered by these high clouds, and they are already high clouds streaming in here. And within the hour, we'll probably get to more of an overcast. See a decent amount of ice still on the lake, but it's a grayer ice, so it is somewhat thinner, but it is covering much of the lake. And uh, that should break apart a little bit after today as temperatures start to go up. Future cast, uh, keeping things dry for today. Into tonight, uh, the clouds come in from a warm front. Probably won't amount to much as far as precip goes, and uh, even into tomorrow morning. Uh, the southerly winds may actually boost our lows tonight to uh, temperatures uh, maybe close to freezing by daybreak. And for uh, tomorrow, uh, keeping it dry until uh, probably late in the afternoon. Some showers come in here and a little wet snow. A uh, band or two may come through uh, from uh, late evening through midnight. Might be able to squeeze out an inch of accumulation before it tapers off after midnight. And uh, we're left with uh, some temperatures into the 40s, maybe a touch of rain or snow on Wednesday. Now looking farther down the road to next week, uh, thank you, Craig Flint, by the way, for this map. And uh, what it shows is a definite warm-up overall. It doesn't mean every single day next week will be warm, uh, but the general trend for the whole week will be towards some milder temperatures, no doubt, while the cold stays off in the east. So for today here uh, along the lake shore, uh, sunshine, then clouds later on, highs in the lower to mid-30s. Further inland, again, increasing clouds and temperatures in the lower to mid-30s as well. Chautauqua Laganey area, you'll see some sunshine. Clouds thicken up later in the day, lower to mid-30s for you as well. A few flakes, maybe a drop of rain late tonight. Lows in the 20s. 28 near, Erie, rise into 32 by daybreak. Uh, afternoon showers tomorrow. Temperatures lower, maybe mid-40s, a little higher perhaps than what we have here. And then uh, the showers will go to some wet snow for Tuesday night. An inch, maybe two primarily in the evening. Some scattered light rain or snow showers on Wednesday. Cold hit for Thursday. We should get close to the 50s by the upcoming weekend. Get up.